All right, guys, right now I am traveling across the United States in that giant RV right there, filming 100 Spirit Halloween stores. I just filmed number 49 yesterday in Bismarck, North Dakota with Joe Bean Videos, where I was absolutely ambushed by fans. That video is coming up, but today I wanna show you some more things that I bought from Spirit Halloween right here on this table behind me. Pure Spirit Halloween awesomeness right here guys i'm so excited about every single thing that you see right in front of you first of all it is now fall so it is super cold in the morning so i bought this awesome ghost face blanket this is one of the new designs that they came out that they have on the shirts and as soon as i saw that they put them on the blankets too i knew i had to get one check it out it says scary movies and chill it has ghost face busting out through the old style tv and it has what looks like a horror sticker up at the top like you would see on the old vhs tapes absolutely awesome blanket and super warm the next thing is this awesomely huge butcher knife. If you guys haven't watched my Children of the Corn video, you've got to go watch it now. I actually got to visit where they filmed one of my favorite horror movies ever, Children of the Corn. And I bought this knife specifically to use in that video, and then I forgot I had it. So I used it for the thumbnail. I was actually going to sign it and leave it there in town for a lucky fan, but once it became part of Children of the Corn, I couldn't leave it. All right, next let's look at this little Freddy Krueger, a little plush Freddy Krueger. How cool is this guy? He's only about six inches tall and he has little soft blades on his hand there, but he is so awesome. I couldn't pass him up. I can't remember if he was 12 or $16, but he was well worth it. And he sits on my desk while I edit my videos. Next, we have the Fright in the Box inflatable guys. I've been wanting to buy this guy, but every time I see him, I walk away. He is eight feet tall. He is absolutely awesome. He lights up. He is so much better than the actual Fright in the Box animatronic because it seemed like the animatronic was just kind of faulty. The top kept falling off, but he looks absolutely awesome and I cannot wait to blow him up. Next is the Ghost Face Lava Lamp. Look at this thing, guys. This thing is so absolutely awesome. Ghost Face right there on the base, red water inside, and black lava. This is 14 inches tall and I cannot wait to see it in action. Guys, I got lucky with this. This is not even supposed to be sold at Spirit Halloween. It's supposed to be sold only at Spencer's, but Spirit is owned by Spencer's and the Spirit that I bought this at actually got one of them accidentally. I found it on a shelf, so I bought it. And last but not least, guys, we have three full cases of blind bags. We have the Universal Studios Monsters, Hocus Pocus, and the Nightmare Before Christmas. Now the Universal Monsters, I actually picked up a little while ago, but it was not a full case. I think there were 10 of them in here, so I had to buy four more from one store and two more from another store to complete this one before I open them. But these two here I bought as complete cases. I actually counted wrong when I bought the Hocus Pocus ones, and I thought there were only 15, so I threw another one in there, got up to the counter, and there was actually 17, so I had to take one out. So, it could end up that I don't actually get every one of them in this, because it may not have actually been a full untouched case. We are going to find out though, because we are going to open each and every single one of them. All three cases of the blind bags, the inflatable, and the lava lamp. If you wanna see those open, follow the link in the comments below and come over to my other channel. Make sure you subscribe and we're gonna be opening all of that stuff. The channel is called That Nate Guy on Halloween. It's a brand new channel that I started specifically for things that are not just Spirit Halloween stores. So hit that link below. Make sure you go over there and subscribe. Hit the bell so you get notifications and we're gonna get these things opened up.